Wartime queues, which fast became a feature of the British way of life, are about to become a memory. Britain's inherent love of queuing, a long-standing tradition. Throughout history, we have mostly formed an orderly queue, whether it's for Wimbledon or a bargain. Patients for waiting around be waning. Well, it turns out that clever academics have in fact been studying the art of queuing. Yes, there is such a thing. And we haven't just been idly standing around like this in an orderly fashion for generations for no reason. There is in fact a method to all of this. And it turns out that six is the magic number. Yes, researchers found that on average we'll wait for six minutes or less in a queue before giving up in frustration. Well, you'll never get that time back. And people are unlikely to join a queue that has more than, you guessed it, six people in it. And keeping with the theme, six inches in between queuers is the minimum amount of personal space needed to avoid stress. So now it's time to consult our esteemed panel of patient queuers outside the Science Museum. In life, do you really not like queuing for? Hate queuing for theme parks. Really? Why? Because you're <laughs> queuing longer for like an hour and then you're only on the ride for like a minute or two. And you can see the ride right in front of you? Yeah. And you just can't get on it? Uh-huh. So is it frustrating? Yeah. Queuing for food, oh, definitely, when you're, if you're hungry. When you get hangry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, angry yeah, yeah. and hangry. Angry, like yeah, yeah. If you're at the front of the line, yeah. and then someone just pushes in, and then you're right, really angry because it's something important. It happens it's all the really, time. Yeah. Do you get really annoyed? Yeah. That queue. No, Look at it. We don't want to we don't, do we that. Hadn't, I didn't realise it was that long. Will it ever end? <laughs> <laughs> And if you haven't got time to hang around, I can sum up that the research tells us our tempers get short when the queues get long. Minnie Stevenson, 5 News.